Nicola, uh, Coach Malone said you guys didn't have what you needed tonight, and he kind of left it, left it at that. What do, what do you think was missing from the overall effort? I mean, I, mean, I think it was an interesting game. Uh, we, I think it was really good basketball for the guys and fans that likes to basketball. I think guys, uh, both teams had their runs. Then in one moment it was a tie game for like long stretch. They they went on the run in the last couple minutes, uh, and that's how they won the game. What we were missing, uh, I don't know. Uh, we it seems like they made a lot of shots, uh, especially the second second half. Um, some of them are open, some of them are not open. Some of them are, you know, it's, it's part of the game, part of the basketball. Um, we need to do the, the better job with that, just to. Uh, Make them, make them, uh, make a tough, tough shot, or maybe make uh, make, make an extra pass, or I mean, the, just to make them a little bit uh, work for the uh, more, uh, work more for the basket. Nicole, you guys had some success in the regular season in the two wins you had over Denver, uh, over the Wolves in the fourth quarter against Ant. He had 12 in the fourth tonight. Um, what was he able to do against you guys to close this thing out and just? Overall, just what type of opponent are you facing in number five? Uh, I mean, to be honest, yeah, of course, he's a special player. I have a huge respect for him. He's a, he can do everything on the floor. You know, it's um, you know you need to enjoy and respect. Uh, I think you need to enjoy and respect your your opponent, just how how good and how talented he is. Uh, uh, but you know, it was him in the first half. He scored like twenty something in the first half, and then it was Cat. Uh, Mike had uh, Mike only had some big big uh, points. Um, uh, Nazareth had an amazing four quarter, uh, and, and uh, of course Ant had a uh, had a really good four quarter too. So I mean they 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 are really talented team, and uh, that's why they, that's why they are the number one seed most of the most of the year. Nicola, what did they do defensively tonight that made it challenging for you, and in particular when Rudy Gobert was covering you? How did he make it difficult? I mean, you know, it's not just him. They have a couple of guys that uh, they, they, they they can rotate. Uh, um, and they and they they are long. They're physical. They are uh, they're making you uh, make or take uh, top shots. Uh, and not just that. You know, they are no. They know what they're doing in a pick and roll. They are. Uh, they put a lot of uh, good defenders on Jamal and and Reggie in a pick and roll. So, um, I think they're they're a really good team. This is in the native language, Alexander Zhukic, Radio TV, Serbia. Nikola Odlicha, tvoj igra, 32 pojena, 8 skoka, 9 asistencija. Kako ste živo na licu mjesta na parketu, kako je sve izgledalo za tebe? Pa, pa ja mislim da je bila sjajna utakmica, ovaj, interesantna. Obe ekipe su imali, ovaj, kako da kažem, neke dobre, no, neke dobre periode. Onda treća četvrina, da kažemo, bila je egal sve vreme. I četvrta četvrina gdje su napravili tu prednost i tako tako pobedili ovaj utakmicu imaju imaju sjajnu ekipu defanzivno i ofanzivno uh, tako da to nadamo se nadamo se da će ovaj da odigramo puno bolje u, u sljedećem meču šta će primiti drugo za sljedeću utakmicu i da li odjeljuješ kao neki veliki poraz ili jednostavno samo kao jedno od sedam utakmica uh, pa mislim da to jedno od sedam utakmica tu govore ovi što izgube ovi što pobede ovaj kaže ovaj ne, ne govore to tako da bi volio da smo mi pobedili da su oni rekli ovo je samo jedna od sedam utakmica ovaj vidjet ćemo moramo da budemo bolje defanzivno mnogo su lako davali u koše u drugom polovremenu i I mean, to, je, to je sve što mogu da, da kažem za sada. Uh, Nikola, when, when they shoot 71% in the second half like that, like, like you mentioned, there are efficient halves for guys like Nas Reed, for Mike Conley. Are there sort of defensive discipline things that you guys can identify that were just different from the first half to fix? Or, or is part of that, were you kind of living with some of the shots that they were able to knock down? What's kind of the balance in terms of how you evaluate that uh, half? I mean, I mean, we're gonna live with, of course, with a with a bank shot of 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 Naz or of Cat, or not Cat, uh, Rudy, but there were some 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 easy easy basically layups. Um, some of them are matchups, probably. Some of them are just uh, concepts, and some of them are just guarding. You know, 
um, I think when the someone was shooting 75, 2 percent, whatever, it's a little bit of everything. You know, it's not just one thing. Uh, but yes, maybe if you have a mismatch, maybe to help a little bit more, or just to try to be physical, try to be maybe aggressive and, and double some guys. That uh, I don't know. We will see tomorrow. Co Coach mentioned uh, that Jamal didn't really practice much this week. How much respect do you have? For his physical and mental toughness, and how close do you think yeah, I mean, he is? Not? I mean, I I expect him to play, to be honest. But uh, of course, he's a he's a warrior out there, out there, and he's a fighting through everything. And I saw him fighting through everything since since I or him uh, came here. So I mean, I kind of he made me to expect him to play. You guys are defending champ, so I don't know how much motivation you need, but ask some of your teammates, can this loss, I guess, motivate you or re refocus you? Um, loss doesn't motivate me, but maybe just to, you know, be better in something. I mean, I don't know. Uh, loss, doesn't, loss doesn't motivate me. What's, what's the, the adjustment that you can make to, you know, Rudy Gobert's Length and you know not only that, Jim, them just rotating three fresh bigs on you, you know, for most of the game. To have duplicate clone of myself, <laughs> and then I can, you know, I can be uh, uh, fresh. When they sub another guy, I, I'm going to be fresh. I don't know, my friend. Uh, it's. Uh, that's not, I think that's why they're they're, they're good. They can they can uh, play big. They can play small. They can put a lot of guys on a lot of guys. And uh, they're long, physical. They rebound really well. Uh, they're aggressive. Mm, I mean, I, I'm 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 satisfied with the shots that I took. Some of them are I missed. Some of them are, I, I made. Uh, so I mean, I, I, it's a it's a it's a tough game, and they're a really good def defensive uh, defensive team. Did you learn anything about your team in terms of what it's going to take to beat Minnesota consistently in the series? Uh, definitely focus. Definitely, we need to be the aggressors. Uh, make them, make them tough. Make them, make them. You know, make an ugly game basically, and just find a way. Probably find a way to win a game. Thank you, guys.